Welcome to Real Talk with Reginald D. I'm your host, Reginald D. In today's episode, I'm going to talk about believing in your power. Let's talk. Each one of us possesses a wealth of untapped potential waiting to be unleashed. But far too often, we underestimate the incredible power that lies within us. We let doubt, fear, and external circumstances dictate the course of our lives. Today, I implore you to cast aside those limited beliefs and embrace the fullest potential that resides within each of you. First, you've got to recognize your uniqueness. That's where a lot of people go wrong in life. You are unique. You have unique talents. You have unique aspirations. Everything about you is unique. And you have to understand that if you want to walk in power, your uniqueness will make room for you. you got to understand that when you walk in power and go after the things you desire in your life, you got to do something that makes your dreams come true. you got to put in the work. you got to turn your dreams into action. Once you believe in your power, then you can shape your life. Have faith in your capabilities. Believe that you can accomplish your dreams. Once you believe it, you will accomplish it. Do not lack confidence. We often lack belief in ourselves when we need it the most. You will have many challenges in life. Things are going to come, but you got to believe in you. you got to believe in your power. Believe in the power within you to make things happen. That's what you got to do. Nothing happens without you. You can't worry about what people say about you and your dreams. They are the ones that's hating on you the most because they believe in your power. You don't need no one's approval but your own. That's the only way you're going to be comfortable in this thing called life. That's the way you're going to walk in power. You have to be bold. God did not give us a spirit of fear, but a power of love and a sound mind. Everything you need is inside of you. Everything you need to accomplish your goals and do the things in life that you want to do is inside of you. God gave it to you. Without believing in your power, that is not a lot that can help you fulfill your dreams or your goals. you got to understand you have to believe in your power. You have to believe in you. You were put on this earth for a specific reason. You were set apart for a specific reason. All you got to do is believe it. Walk in it. Everybody can't be you. You are your own you. So walk in it, and I promise you, your life will change. You got to understand that you got to win. You just got to put in your mind that there is no other option but to win. When you put that in your mind, you won't give up. You won't quit. You will keep fighting the fight. And that's the way you were built. That's how God made you. That's what he created in you. And once you accept it, that's when your life will change. God said he gave us the keys to the kingdom. The only thing you got to do is make sure the keys that you got opens the right door. A lot of times in life, we have all these keys. We have all these opportunities, but we put them in the wrong door and the doors won't open. But once you start putting them in the right doors, then doors will start opening in your life over and over and over again. Believe in your power and believe in you will inspire you to take action. It will motivate you. Once you believe in you and you believe in your power, it will motivate you to do the things that you want to do in your life. Nobody else can motivate you like you can. Most people try to motivate you, but nobody can motivate you like you can. You know you. You know what makes you drive. You know what lights a fire in you. So you've got to be faithful to yourself and motivate yourself to go to the next level in life and get the things that you desire for your life. Your brain will always play tricks on you, and I need you to know this. But you can stay on track if you believe in you and your power. Don't be afraid. Your brain is going to tell you it's too much. It's going to tell you, I don't think I can do it. But as long as you keep pushing, as long as you keep grinding, as long as you keep fighting the good fight and going after the things that you desire for your life, trust me, things will happen in your life. I'm being honest with you. No matter what you go through in life, no matter where you are right now, the biggest driver you have is purpose. Purpose will keep you going. Purpose will make you overcome things that you're dealing with in life. Purpose will make you more than a conqueror. Your purpose will make sure you stay on track. But if you don't have purpose or you don't walk in purpose, that's when the inner you dies. That's when you give up. Your purpose is your power. And when you believe in your purpose, then you will believe in your power. That's how it works. You have to realize that afraid people don't accomplish nothing. You have to go after it. You have to fight the fight. Because if you don't, guess what? You won't accomplish anything. You'll be wondering every day what could have happened. Where would I be if I had taken that one step? Where would I be if I had taken that risk? 
You can't keep those questions in your mind throughout your life because all that is going to do is defeat you. It's going to deflate you. You have to go for it regardless of how scared you are, regardless of how you feel, regardless of what somebody says about you. You have the power within you to overcome and conquer anything that you come up against. It's your life. You know your life. God knows your life, and he's got your back. you got to get out there and work the process. Greatness is inside of you, and you have to realize that there is nothing greater than you. When you wake up every day in the morning, you should say that to yourself. There is nothing greater than me. You have what it takes, and it takes what you got. But you got to keep working it, and you can't be afraid. You got to walk in power. You got to walk in who you are. You got to walk in boldness because you are all you got at the end of the day. Some people may come along. Some people may help you. But when it's all said and done, you are all you got. Work the process, and the process will work itself. You always got to stay positive regardless of what you go through, regardless of how things may seem. It may be dark at times and you don't see the light at the end of the tunnel, but you got to keep working the process. One day you will realize it and it will come full fold that all the work you do, everything you do was not in vain. Never stop learning. And that's what people go wrong a lot of times in life. They think that I got it and I can do it my way and this and that, but never stop learning. You always got to try to adapt in life. Every hand that you have been dealt can't be played the same way. Sometimes you got to adapt to get what you want out of this thing called life. Sometimes you have to understand that your knowledge is power. You have to understand that working and grinding every day is critical because you're learning things. You're learning life lessons. You're learning stuff on the job. It really is the life lessons that's going to take you to the next level. Embrace it. Make the changes. Adapt to what you can and walk away from the things that you can't deal with, the things that's not serving you. That's not serving your purpose. Because at the end of the day, your life is your life. I need you to understand you got to visualize your success. You have to see yourself somewhere and you have to say, where am I going to be in the next five years? Where am I going to be in the next 10 years? Where am I going to be in the next year? Once you visualize it, then you can understand it. Once you visualize it, then it ignites a fire in you to go after it because now you saw it. Once you see it, 90% of the time you can achieve it. But you got to see it first. You got to see yourself being great. You got to see yourself being successful. If you look at yourself every day and say, I'm less than, I will never have nothing. I will never get to the top. Then you will live that life forever. And that's not what you want to do. That is not who you are. That is not how you're built. You are built different. You just have to see it. And if you can't see it, you definitely can't achieve it. Never surrender. Never surrender in life with things that's going to take your dreams away or with things that's going to take your vision away. Let stuff like that go because all that's going to do is deflate you. You have so much going for you. You have life ahead of you. Years of happiness, years of success. You just got to understand who you are and you got to understand it takes work. And once you understand that about you, the rest is history. You can go far in life. You can go further than you ever thought in this life, but you got to understand you. And once you understand you, then you understand your life. Once you understand your reality, you will understand your life. Then you can walk in power. Once you understand what you're doing, once you understand your assignment, once you understand your purpose, your power kicks in and you will start accomplishing things that you never thought you would accomplish. You'll start getting things in life that you never thought you would get just because you believed in your power. You believed in your purpose. You were relentless and going after it. Never, ever give up. That's the thing that hurts people the most. They give up all the time. They give up because of a bad relationship. They give up because they got laid off a job. They give up because of family problems. You can't quit regardless of the adversities you go through in life. you got to stay in the fight. You have purpose inside of you. You have to keep going regardless of what it looks like. you got some things in your life that you got to do. So you got to keep going. You can't quit. You can't quit on your life. Your life is precious. You are here for a reason. Walk in your power. Do the things that's life changing for you. Do the things that's life changing for your community and your family. Do the things that's life changing all the way around your life. And once you start doing those things, then you understand your assignment. And once you understand your assignment, then you will definitely understand your life. Keep pushing. Keep going. Don't let anything hold you back. I know the weight of the world is heavy sometimes, but you can't let the weight of the world bring you down. You are designed to carry weight. That's who you are. You carry weight. 
Keep pushing. Keep going. Make the best of this thing called life. Make the best of everything you put your hands to. Do it with greatness. Do it with integrity. Do it with love. Keep pushing. Keep doing the things that make you great. Every little step you take is one step closer to your purpose, to your goals, and to what you desire in your life. And you have to understand this. You're not alone. God has you. He got your back. He just needs you to work the process. He just needs you to put in the work. He got you. There is nothing in this world that you can't handle. So you got to stand the fight. You have to. It's your fight. Nobody else is going to do it for you. It's yours. Appreciate it. Appreciate the process. Appreciate the struggles because it's only going to make you better. It's only going to get you to the promise that God has for you in your life. Stay in the fight and don't quit. Keep going. Let your light shine in this world. Let your light be a light to somebody else. Because the more you give, the more power you feel. The more you show God's love through you, the more opportunities will come your way. Trust me, I know this. Never be selfish in this thing called life. Just be careful. Everybody does not deserve your care. Everybody does not deserve what you have to offer. But a lot of people do. You just got to understand who does and who don't. But at the end of the day, you got to take care of yourself. You have to stay focused. You got to readjust. And you got to understand that your life is so valuable that you have to do what it takes to make it great. You got to do what it takes to protect it. You have to do what it takes to meet your goals. You have to do what it takes to walk in purpose. Thank you for tuning in with Real Talk the rest of the day. If you enjoyed the show, please share with anyone you feel that needs to go on this journey with us on being a better you. See you next time.